a true evaluation of gynecomastia has some tests that we run to make sure that it's not other reasons. 75% of it is idiopathic. That means we don't know what happens. It's just due to hormonal changes. Sometimes it could be due to your thyroid, your testes, you have prolactin tumors, or you have other germ cells or testicular germ cell tumors. But most of the time, 75% of the time, it's idiopathic. It's, there's no reason behind it. It's probably related to hormones. Some medications that cause gynecomastia, a lot of men are on Propecia these days for hair loss. Steroids is a definite. Uh, people that use steroids to build up muscle or, or have done cycles at younger ages, that could be the cause. Anti-anxiety medications such as Valium, antidepressant, antibiotics. So there's a whole slew of medication that can cause gynecomastia. Substances that can cause alcohol and marijuana, yes. Since marijuana is legal, it should be brought up that it has been known to cause gynecomastia, and I've seen plenty of it here in Los Angeles and Beverly. Health conditions, as we talked about, some stuff with your gonads, your aging, tumors, thyroid, kidney failure, liver failure, malnutrition. Mm -hmm.